Hi, this is Bridget with Zebra Glitter and Nails, Positively Zebra, the Daily Stripe. And we are going to be doing the gel, uh, dip nails with a gel top coat. So we're gonna grab our dip base, dip top coat, and our activate for dip. Okay, and some people activate and some don't for this. So I feel you need to, or else your process doesn't work right. Uh, keep an alcohol pump bottle with lint-free wipes, um, dust brush, scrub brush, or toothbrush, an old one if you have one that you can use, um, any buffing blocks, um, anything like that for shaping that you need, cuticle pusher, or and an orange stick. I always keep an orange stick around or um, some type of tool for cleaning around the cuticle. This one works great too. So I think we have these on the website. I know we have these on the website. Um, and we have these on the website. So first thing you're gonna do is your prep. You're gonna wash your hands. You're gonna do clean up your cuticles. So push your cuticles back, make sure you get the sidewalls. Make sure the cuticles are totally out of the way. Okay, that is important. Every finger, every hand. You can wash again at that point if you want to make sure you get any of the pieces off that might still be there. Um, I use our bond at this point, so our pH bond. And um, I swear by the bond, it helps uh, bind with the keratin and makes everything last longer. It's perfect. You can use it on your natural nail or you can use it on tips. That's a tip I'm putting it on. I do that on my actual full coverage tips, which are not done right now, but they're on. Okay, and then that dries pretty fast. Make sure it's dry. We're gonna use uh, Jason V, which is Jason Vorez, one of our Halloween colors, but uh, from, I think that was two years ago, um, for Halloween in a sub bag. We had all the different, um, Think, I call them, we have Boys of Horror. I think that's that one, the Boys of Horror, this one came from. We have another one that has like some Halloween different things too. Okay, so uh, again, we're going to do the gel method, gel top coat with dip nails. So we're going to do our normal dip process, guys. So you're going to put on your dip base, and we're going to do our apex first. So just right down the middle, about three-fourths of the way down. And I'm doing pour over, and I got way too much. <laughs> Luckily, I keep your cupcake liner because that helps save everything. Everything's slippery. I'm on the slope. Okay, and then you can dump it back in as you go or at the end, however you want to do it. Tap that off real good. Then you're going to brush it off. Shouldn't have any cleanup at this point because you just did the apex area. Uh, so you can move on. And we're gonna go ahead and do the next layer, staying away from the very, from the skin. You wanna just, in the cuticle, you wanna just get everything down here. So you can lay it down, not a fan. We do have great black fan brushes now. I happen to have the old one on this set, but pour over again. And with a pour over method, you can dump as much on as you want. It's just gonna kind of fall off at the end. So you don't have to worry that it's gonna like ripple or mess up at that point. Okay, brush off. And then your orange stick comes in handy here. Do your cleanup. Now, some people clean up in between the liquid and the dip. I pretty much do it at this point. You can, I don't have my glasses on, so you can tell. I can miss a little spot here. So um, we're gonna make sure we catch that this next go. And again, I'm using a sample jar here, so I am dumping it as we go. But that way you don't waste too much unless you spill it like I just did. Okay, this is a color changer. It's a red to gray color changer. It's really cool. Okay, last layer with the base. Make sure you get your edges. Make sure you get over here where I had missed this earlier, and that's what happens when you don't wear glasses for a video. Sorry, the um, glare is awful. I don't know how to get rid of that in a video with lighting and all that. So that's, that's all you need of your... Um, base coat and then dump again. Make sure you get that little piece there that was not gotten earlier. 
And like I said, you can kind of get as much on there as you want. It's going to fall away. It's not going to cause a problem. If any of that's still wet, dump again. Okay. Make sure you get as much dip as you want. You can do as many of those layers as you like. Some people do two, some do three, some do four and five. I don't like mine very thick, so I make sure I get it on right and only do a couple usually. Okay. And the cupcake liner can be pitched because it's nice and red from this dip, so we're not going to reuse it. You can reuse your cupcake liners as long as obviously your colors are very different. Okay. And at this point, I don't know if I cleaned. We're going to clean around here again. And again, you can clean between the liquid and dip step if you like, or like I do after you dip. Um, brush it off and then scrub brush too. So use your scrub brush and get any excess dip off of there. Oops, sorry, I kind of fudged the end of that there. I think I missed a spot. So make sure you get everything. Again, I have my glasses on, so, or not on, so I had a little trouble. Um, anyways, so at this point, and once you get that brushed real well, scrub brushed off, um, you're going to go ahead and activate. I activate, not everyone activates when doing the gel method. So I feel you need to activate, you need that reaction. Your activator makes a chemical reaction with the dip and the, the uh, base coat base uh, dip base and if you don't have that you're not going to have the strength or the hardness that your dip nails are supposed to have so second layer of activate is a little more precise if you don't get your activate on right guys it can cause rippling or like the white dots that sometimes you think your liquid or your dips are messed up or not mixed right or something it's just that okay so wait your two minutes set a timer that reaction has to happen um okay so this is the part where you have to be a little impatient you can get ready if you want to get an alcohol prep out uh, a lint-free wipe alcohol on it um, some people like to wipe in between at this stage. So, uh, after that dries, after the two minutes, we got about another minute left. Okay. And I know for a video, it's kind of, eh, you're sitting here waiting and then real life we get rushed and we don't want to wait, but wait the two minutes, let that reaction happen. And again, some people do skip the activate when they're doing a gel top coat, but I feel it's super important. So do that and it'll last. Okay, just a few more seconds here. And then we are gonna do a video in a bit of the full gel method with uh, dip powder. You can do the gel method with dip powder. You can do the gel method with the puff powders. You can do the gel method lay in, pour over, all those different things as well. Okay been two minutes. You do not have to do this step. I've gotten used to doing it. That's just wiping down everything around that you might have missed. Um, and then any activate that might have, if you flooded it and got too much on there, the activate might not be totally dry yet. So just wipe that away. Let that dry. You don't want to trap moisture. Next step, you have got to put on, which I knocked the sticker loose. Sorry, I use mine way too much for this. Um, we have little stickers on top that, that are in different stickers for different products. So we need our gel base and our gel top coat now. Gel base, gel top. You have to have a gel base, guys. Your, if you don't have a gel base, your gel top is going to peel off. Okay, it's not going to stay on there. So go ahead and... We're going to apply the gel base, so just nice, again, just like you're doing your, your dip liquids. Pull it down, you don't need a lot, just a thin layer, getting all of the nail. You can clean up, your gel has to be set with an LED or UV light lamp. So clean up there. You don't want that to harden. You can pick it off. It picks off pretty easy. That's going to look weird because I'm taking the finger and I'm putting her in the UV light. So we're going to set that for about 10 or 15 seconds. 
just enough to get it um, started. You need it tacky still for the top coat to stick. Okay, so that's your gel base. And then as we wait here, I'm gonna fix my sticker that I keep knocking off. Oh, well, now I don't know what I did with it. Oh well, okay, we'll do that later. <laughs> Alrighty. And there's that. Go ahead and back up here so you can see it. It should still be tacky. Don't touch it like I did, but it'll still be tacky. I was trying to show that. And then you're going to do your gel top coat. So your gel base is what you have to have for the gel top coat to adhere. It has to basically have a reaction as well and something to adhere to. So your gel top coat, and I love ours. It is very popular. A lot of other companies buy it in bulk to sell it as well. So um, gel top. You can do two layers of gel top if you want. Just... Um, I usually do one. It's super shiny. And then to put that in, sorry, my finger's rolling around. <laughs> I'll be right back. Okay, so 60 seconds for that and let that cure. And then you're going to have a beautiful mani with dip powder, the nice hardness because it's activated, and then your gel base and your gel top coat. And then you have dip nails with a gel top coat. And next video we'll do is a full gel process with dip liquids or with dip powder, sorry. Okay, there we go. And that's pretty shiny. So I'm not even gonna do another layer. You can do a second layer if you need, but um, as long as you have your shine, you don't really need to unless you want the extra layers. Make sure you cap. I'm not sure that I did. Always cap and get your sidewalls too when you're doing your top coat. Beautiful though, and that's Jason. You can see the gray and the reddish maroonish color. It's super cool color, and it's a thermal changer. So have a great day. Thank you for signing in with Bridget to Positively Zebra, the Daily Stripe Zebra Glitter and Nails. Have a great day.